Before routing, if the connections between pins are not visible, go into Setup Display Colors and make sure that the connection color is not the same as the background color. Next, make sure that the active layer is the layer you want to be routing on. In this example, we'll use the top layer. This can be changed by either using the drop down in the toolbar or using the modeless command L and then the routing layer you want to use. Next, use the modeless command DRP or design rule prevent. This ensures we will not be breaking any design rules when doing the routing. Now let's route some connections. Notice that I can route one pin pair and then run another one in the same area and it will push the trace out of the way if it's going to break any design rules. To quickly finish a route, double click the left mouse button when close to the end pin. For a route that ends on a via, you can use the shift button and then left click to drop a via and then the control button and click to end the route. In Maker Layout, we can also bus route. Select the pins you want to bus route and then right click bus route. You will be routing one trace, but as you click your left mouse button to tack down the trace, the other traces will follow. If you need to add a via, you can do shift click and it will add the vias, and you can use control tab to change the via pattern for the bus. To finish the route, click the end pin of all of the traces.